Okay, next one. Then it was Colin and Pharaoh's turn. Sit, Pharaoh, she said. But Pharaoh didn't sit. Pharaoh was not paying any attention to Colin. She jumped too interesting. No, he was too interested in watching Jack's bunny jump in, jump in and out of their boxes. Suddenly, Pearl leaped out of the bunnies who hopped toward Manny and knocked over her hamster cage. Pudgy, 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 the hamster escaped and began run around. In circles, while Kyle saw Jack howled, "This is a disaster, and I have to do something." Sit! I shout at Kyle. Quiet! I order Jack. Stay! I yell. Every kid and uh, what? What am I? I yell. Everyone, kids and pets, stop to stand. The, even the audience froze. Daniel, that was incredible," said Carl. "You got the pet so down. That was a quiet, quite a achievement." Sally, that was the end of the pet show. But now I have more confidence when I have to speak in front of the people. And even though I am still nervous around animals, Carol and I become great friends. And I discover my talent too. Great. Okay. So <clears throat> here's my question. It's about Daniel. What did Daniel learn from? Keep my talent about ordering pets. Great. Like if they Thing is a pet. He said, "Um, what did I, what did I say? Sit, jump." Exactly. <laughs> Daniel like that. learned that he has a talent for commanding pets. Okay. Right. Yep. Okay. Command. Start with C O. That's very good. Command is also to right with. Yeah. You command another person, or in this case, you command a pet to give command. Daniel gave a command to Pero. Right. Okay. What commands did Daniel give Kara? Sit. Yeah, that's all. He said sit. 